Good morning, and welcome to St. Augustine Church. I am Noel Panlilio, the and District Master of the Northern California District, Unipero Serra Province, the fourth degree of the Knights of Columbus. And I am Fanny Panlilio. Thank you for joining us in this second day of our prayer offering of the Novena for Life and the Holy Rosary to our Blessed Mother to defend life and restore legal protection to the unborn. For the second day of Novena, the common outcry, which is justly made on behalf of human rights, is false and illusory if the right to life the most basic and fundamental right and the condition for all other personal rights is not defended with maximum determination. That is Pope Saint John Paul II. The intention for the welcoming of every human life in law and culture. For our intercession for today is for the women making the abortion decision. It's impossible to know the full extent of the pressure to abort that is created by our anti-life society. Only the women, woman who has experienced an unplanned pregnancy knows the coercive power of the culture of death, which is often augmented by family and friends as well as unsympathetic work environments. We intercede for all women who are experiencing the pressure to abort at this very moment and who know in the heart of the hearts that the decision goes against their very basic human and maternal instincts. May our prayers assist them to choose life without fear and without compromise. Petition for virtue, for charity. We also ask God for the gift of true charity in our hearts toward the woman who finds herself in this vulnerable situation and also for those who have already made the decision for abortion. We also pray that our charity will have an impact on the lives of all those involved in the abortion decision. May they find love in their hearts for the most innocent of all God's children, the unborn child. Life program intention, Silver Rose. Holy Virgin of Guadalupe, Queen of the Angels and Mother of the Americas, patroness of unborn children, 
we implore your intercession. Give us your compassion to care for those tempted to abort and your comfort to give to those that have suffered from a past abortion. Lead us to overcome this grave evil in our nation as we love, as we look for the future when the dignity of all human life will be restored. We ask this in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ, who is love and mercy itself. Amen. We now pray the sorrowful mysteries. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin, of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there, he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. For increased faith and hope and charity, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, word without an amen. The first sorrowful mystery, the agony in the garden. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, word without them. Amen. O, o my, my Jesus, Jesus, forgive, forgive us, us our sins. sins. Save us, Save from, us, the us from the fires of hell. Of hell. And lead, lead all souls, souls into heaven, heaven especially, especially those, those in most need of, of thy mercy. The second sorrowful mystery, the scratching at the pillar. Our Father, who art in heaven, holy be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as this in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my, o my Jesus, Jesus, forgive, forgive us, our us our sins. Save, Save us from the fires of hell, of hell and lead all souls, souls to heaven, heaven especially those in most need of thy, of thy mercy. The third sorrowful mystery, the crowning with thorns. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen.
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, word without an amen. O my Jesus, o my Jesus forgive, forgive us our sins, sins. save, save us, us from the fires, fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, heaven especially those in most need of thy mercy. mercy. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. Our Father, who art in heaven, holy be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was the beginnings, now and ever shall be world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, o my Jesus forgive, forgive us our, our sins. sins. Save, Save us, us from the fires of hell. Of hell. And lead all souls into heaven, heaven especially those in most need of, of thy mercy. mercy. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion and death of our Lord Jesus Christ. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, word without an amen. O oh my Jesus, Jesus forgive, forgive us our sins, sins. Save, save us from the fires of hell, of hell. and lead all souls, souls into heaven, heaven especially, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Queen Mother of Mercy, hail, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To do, you do we cry, poor banished children, children of Eve, to you do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in the valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, your eyes of mercy towards us. And after this exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise to the same Christ our Lord. Amen. God, our Heavenly Father, source of all life and goodness, creator of all things, we turn to you with deep humility and ask you to restore respect for the sanctity of all human life in our society and in our world. The culture of death is so pervasive and powerful today that our only hope is to trust entirely in your, in your grace to transform it into a culture of life. We make this prayer in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Our novena in honor of Santo Nino. Opening prayer. O oh, my dear Jesus, you are our King and our God. Because of your love for us, you came down from heaven, born of the Virgin Mary. My heart weeps, for in spite of your goodness, we have committed many sins. Forgive us, O oh Jesus, for our sin of ingratitude in return for your goodness. Strengthen our will to resist temptation and sin. With your grace, we will be able to fulfill our promises and share with your glory in heaven. O holy child Jesus, who is ever good and loving, we kneel before you, our true God. With humility, we implore you to give us your mercy and grant us all the favors we ask of you in this novena so that we will enjoy the blessings of heaven. Amen. O oh, merciful Jesus, help the men and women hear your call to serve. Our needs are great and our people thirst for your presence. Open the hearts of many, raise up faithful servants of the gospel, dedicated holy sisters, brothers, deacons, and priests, who will give themselves for your people and their needs. Bless those who are serving now with courage and perseverance. Grant that many will be inspired by their faith and example. We ask this in your holy name. Amen. 
We now solemnly ask Senor Santo Nino to hear our prayers and grant our petitions during this novena. Let us pray. O oh, sweet and merciful Jesus, Señor Santo Niño, the source of all goodness, we know we kneel before your sacred image, imploring your divine aid for universal peace and brotherhood among all men. Enlighten the unbelievers and the heathens so that they will believe you as their true God. Restore the faith of those who have wandered away from you Bring them back to your fold with repentance in their hearts. Grant also to faithful departed in purgatory the remission of all their sins so that they will rest in peace forever. Finally, nourish and strengthen our faith in you so that we will serve you faithfully on earth. Amen. Supplications to Santo Nino. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ have mercy on us. Christ have mercy on us. Lord have mercy on us. Lord have mercy on us. Jesus hear us. Jesus graciously hear us. In every need, let me come to you with humble trust. Santo Nino help us. In all our doubts, perplexities, and temptations. Santo Nino help us. In hours of loneliness, weariness, and trials. Santo Nino help us. In the failures of our plans and hope. Santo Nino, help us. In disappointments, troubles, and sorrows. Santo Nino, help us. When others fail us and your grace alone can, can assist us. Santo Nino, help us. When we throw ourselves on your tender love as our only refuge. Santo Nino, help us. When we are ill and our head and hands cannot work and we are lonely. Santo Nino, help us. When we feel impatient and our cross irritates us. Santo Nino, help us. Always, in spite of weaknesses, faults, and shortcomings of every kind. Santo Nino, help us. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Spare us, O Jesus. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Graciously hear us, O Jesus. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us, O Jesus. Jesus, hear us. Jesus, graciously hear us. Let us pray. O Santo, o Santo Nino, Nino, who has said, Ask, ask and you shall receive, receive. Seek and, and you shall find. Knock and, and it shall be opened unto you. Give, give we beseech you to us who ask the gift of our divine love, love, that we may that we love you love with, our, with our, our whole heart, heart in words and deeds, and never cease from showing forth your praise. Make us, O Lord, to have a perpetual fear and love of your holy name, for you never fail to govern them whom you solidly establish in your love, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Our concluding prayer. O miraculous Santo Nino, prostrate before your sacred image, we beseech you to cast a merciful look on our, on our, on our troubled hearts. Let your tender love so inclined to pity be softened to our prayers and grant us that grace for which we ardently implore you. Take from us all unbearable afflictions and despair for your sacred infancy's sake. Hear our prayers and send us consolation and aid that we may praise you with the Father and the Holy Spirit forever and ever. Amen. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.
Good morning. Welcome to St. Augustine Church, South San Francisco, California. Today's uh, mass intentions are for the deceased, Guillermo Ramos Jr., Julieta Habeliana, Danilo Tamayo, Edmond Ballesteros, Luisa Estanislao, Rafael Lopez. Jun Panelo Benita Queja, Emigdio Flores Liberty Gonzalez, Arsenia and Antonio Reyes. For healing, Imelda Santos, Regina Sagon, Denison Raval, and Tim Chung. In thanksgiving for Del Sagala, and a special intention, Raval family.
good morning good morning father and welcome my dear brothers and sisters to the celebration of life we are blessed because we are alive we are blessed because god has given to each and every one of us the gift of life and we are here to celebrate that gift that god has so generously given to each one of us which we also take for granted many a time in our lives with our thinking with our thanking god for the gift of life therefore let's my dear friends make this celebration truly a celebration of life in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen the lord be with you and with your spirit in the silence of our hearts let us pray for god's mercy forgiveness and compassion May almighty God have mercy on us forgive us our sins and bring us to everlasting life amen let us attend to the pleas of your people with the heavenly care o lord we pray that they may see what must be done and gain strength to do what they have seen through our lord jesus christ your son who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the holy spirit one god forever and ever amen A reading from the first book of Samuel. All the elders of Israel came in a body to Samuel at Ramah and said to him, Now that you are old and your sons do not follow your example, appoint a king over us as other nations have to judge us. Samuel was displeased when they asked for a king to judge them. He prayed to the Lord, however, who said in an answer, Grant the people's every request. It is not you they reject. They are rejecting me as their king. Samuel delivered the message of the Lord in full to those who were asking him for a king. He told them, The rights of the king who will rule you will be as follows. He will take your sons and assign them to his chariots and horses, and they will run before his chariot. He also appoints from among them his commanders of groups of a thousand and of a hundred soldiers. He will set them to do his plowing and his harvesting. and to make his implements of war and the equipment of his chariots he will use your daughters as ointment makers as cook and as bakers he will take the best of your fields vineyards and olive groves and give them to his officials he will tithe your crops and your vineyards and give the revenue of his eunuchs and his slaves. He will take your male and female servants, 
as well as your best oxen and your assets, asses, and use them to do his work. He will tithe your flocks, and you yourselves will become his slaves. When this takes place, you will complain against the king whom you have chosen. But on that day, the Lord will not answer you. The people, however, refused to listen to Samuel's warning and said, Not so. There must be a king over us. We too must be like other nations, with a king to rule us and to lead us in warfare and fight our battles. When Samuel had listened to all the people had to say, he repeated it to the Lord, who then said to him, Grant their requests and appoint a king to rule them. The word of the Lord. Thanks. Responsorial Psalm. Forever I will sing the goodness of the Lord. Blessed the people who know the joyful shout. In the light of your countenance, O Lord, they walk. At your name they rejoice all the day, and through your justice they are exalted. Forever I will sing the goodness of the Lord. For you are the splendor of their strength, and by your favor our horn is exalted. For the Lord belongs our shield, and to the Holy One of Israel, our King. Forever. Please stand. <clears throat> prophet has arisen in our midst and God has visited his people. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. And A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Mark. When Jesus returned to Capernaum after some days, it became known that he was at home. Many gathered together so that there was no longer room for them, not even around the door, and he preached the word to them. They came bringing to him a paralytic carried by four men. Unable to get near Jesus because of the crowd, they opened up the roof above him. After they had broken through, they let down the mat on which the paralytic was lying. When Jesus saw their faith, he said to them, Child, your sins are forgiven. Now, some of the scribes were sitting there asking themselves, Why does this man speak that way? He is blaspheming. Who but God alone can forgive sins? Jesus immediately knew in his mind what they were thinking to themselves. So he said, why are you thinking such things in your heart? Which is easier to say to the paralytic, your sins are forgiven, or to say, rise up, pick up your mat, and walk? But that you may know that the Son of Man has authority to forgive sins on earth. He said to the paralytic, I say to you, rise, pick up your mat, and go home. He rose, picked up his mat at once, and went away in the sight of everyone. They were all astounded and glorified God, saying, We have never seen anything like this. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. 
Thank you, Father Ray, for inviting me this morning to come to this beautiful church, St. Augustine, and to offer the Mass with you for all of us. At the beginning of this reflection that I, I am going to share with you, I like to remember with the love and gratitude my mother, my father, for having chosen me to be born, for taking that responsibility, that huge responsibility to have me born and to raise me up in the Catholic Church, in the Catholic faith. She made a huge sacrifice, but I am here today because of that decision my mom made, my dad made many years ago. And so, my dear brothers and sisters, I want all of you to join me at this very moment and think of your mothers and think of them with the love and gratitude because they made the responsibility, they made that sacrifice. They said, I love to have my baby born. I love to nurture, nourish, and raise my child. And that's why we are here today. And so, my dear brothers and sisters, life is a gift of God. God, in his own image and likeness, created each and every one of us. We know that. We know that. Intellectually, we know that. No one will question this, that God created each and every one of us. And in his own image and likeness. But we forget that. We forget that beautiful truth that I am not an accident. My dear friends, we are not an accident. We are not afterthought. We are not a repetition. Each and every one of us is very special. We are God's beloved. Can you imagine that? If you do not believe me, go home today and stand in front of a mirror and you will see the most beautiful creation of God, the, beautiful, the most beautiful child of God reflected on that mirror. And so, my dear brothers and sisters, we must love God, we must thank God that he gave us life and we are not repetition. Now, I will give you a test if you don't believe me. Today, <clears throat> the world has more than six billion people. Can you believe not two of these are alike? Not two. Now you talk about, you know, identical twins. Even the identical twins are not completely identical that they are the same. Look at the, look at the, your right palm, look at the lines on your right palm. If you see in the world another person having exactly the same lines that you have, please come to me, I'm going to give you a million dollar. I mean, I'm just trying to impress upon you how precious you are, how unique you are, how we are God's beloved children. And so, it all begins with life. God has given us, shared that precious gift of life with all of us. Today, my dear friend, we are talking about uh, the sanctity of life and how to protect the sanctity of life. Now for me, in order to understand the sanctity of life, we must understand 
the sanctity of marriage. We must understand the sanctity of family. If you do not see the sanctity of marriage, then we will never see the sanctity of life. Today, our families are under attack. We are in the middle of a war, my dear brothers and sisters. We are in the midst of a huge spiritual war, a huge warfare. And who is our enemy? Our enemy is the devil. So it is said, if you want to prepare yourself to face your enemy, to meet your enemy, to defeat your enemy, you must know who your enemies are before you begin the battle, before you begin the war. And so we must know, my dear brothers and sisters, we must know who our enemy, our enemy, the devil, is. Who is our enemy? What do you know about him? Number one, his only goal, mission in life is to destroy human souls and bring them to eternal damnation. That is the only goal. And for that, our enemy, the devil, will lie. He's a liar. He will make it appear what is absolutely bad. He will make it look it so good. He is a liar. And so I want all of you to understand that the devil is for real. If you believe in God, if you believe in Jesus Christ, we must believe in the devil. And the devil is trying to destroy life. Where does he begin? Where does he begin? How can he destroy the world? How can he destroy the society, the country? Where does he begin? He begins with the family. He attacks the family. He takes away all the value system. He brings us distractions, attractions, all kinds of pressures. And we are caught up. We are caught up. We are unable to make choices in our life or right choices in our life because he's confusing us. He has confused us. And so, my dear brothers and sisters, look at the sanctity of family today. I don't know. In this country, when we, you know, when the priests or deacons prepare the couple for, uh, for the marriage, normally it takes about six months, you know, and they are taught, they are educated. You know, a couple <clears throat> prepare themselves for their marriage for a number of years, and they get, finally they get married, but they forget what are the two fundamental objectives of marriage. I will not ask you. You know why? You may not know. You may be married for many years. I am reminding you, my dear brothers and sisters, today, what are the two fundamental objectives of marriage? Catholic marriage. What is the teaching of the church? Number one, procreation of children. The church, we need to build the church. We are all members of the church because of procreation. Number two, education. Education of our children. Now this is something that many parents don't know. For them, education means what? Educating the children in the best school, the most expensive school, the Catholic schools, the private schools. That's all that they know. That's what education. It's okay. It's okay to educate your children wherever the best schools you can, you can think of, you can find. But that's not education. Educating your children in your faith. In your faith. And so, my dear parents, let me ask this question. You know, one of the fundamental teachings of philosophy is this. 
You can give only what you have. I can give only what I have. It's common sense. If I do not have, how do you expect me to give? And so my question is this, to the parents, parents, if you do not have faith, how can you give faith to your children? We have forgotten this. We have for forgotten. I know, we are very busy today. And the devil has, you know, the devil has ma made us so busy. Today, let me ask you, let me tell you this. If you ask someone, hey, hey Peter, how are you today? What's the most likely answer you can expect from Peter? Peter will tell you, I am very busy. I am very busy. But that's not the answer. I'm asking you, Peter, how are you? Are you okay? Are you happy? Are you sick? But the answer is always, I am busy. I am busy. That is the way the devil has made every man, all of us, very busy. But let me ask you another question. Busy with the what? What are you busy with the what? Many people are scratching their cell phone. From morning till evening, scratching cell phone. They're very busy. They're watching television or, or I don't know. They're busy. The devil has made us busy. Why? He wants to take away. He wants to take away. Take us away from God, from the church. And so, my dear brother, sister, <clears throat> we need to recognize that families are the center of our life. That's where you educate your children. You know, I counseled, I counseled young girls who went through abortion. And I tell you this, they will never forget the, this heinous crime that they have committed. They will never forgive themselves. They carry the guilt for the rest of their life. And so my dear parents, please, education begins in your family. Never do anything Never become too busy at the expense of your children. Teach your, your daughters the beauty of life. Teach your daughters how precious life is, how life is so holy. Teach them, show them the sanctity of life. And that's where we begin. If every family, every mother, every father understands the sanctity of life and they take responsibility to protect life, I promise you there will be no abortion. There will never any abortion. You will not have. Because you understand. My child understands. Every boy and every girl understands that Life is precious. They understand the sanctity of life. And so, my dear brothers and sisters, today, let's make a little resolution to build your families. You know, in St. James, I began two, three years ago this idea. You know, every mass, every mass will be congruent. After, we, after, after I say, let us pray. We pray. Let us not pray for the families. For our children. Look at our families. Look at your families. Haven't you lost your children? Haven't you lost your grandchildren? They don't go to church anymore. They don't need God anymore. I don't blame them. Because they're living in a, in a, in a very challenging time. And so make families. If all the families of St. Augustine makes family number one priority and you will never compromise with the values in your family, we will protect life. We will respect life. We will promote life. I want to add little 
incident, a little anecdote. You know, a Kadisan teacher asked children, small kindergarten children, children, who made you? Who made you? A small little girl, Mary, <clears throat> she said, teacher, a small bit of me, a small bit of me, God made. A small bit of me, God made. And then, God and I make myself. A, God, a small bit, look at a small human baby, the Mary is talking about, the little girl is talking about, you know, human baby, how, how big a human baby is. A small bit of me, God made. And then God and I make. It's a long, it's a lifelong process. We keep ourselves, we make ourselves in the image of God. The more we get closer to God, we glorify God. And that's my prayer to all of you today, all of us today. We must glorify our God, our creator, by respecting, glorifying the gift of life that God has given to me. Amen. Amen. Thank you, thank Lord Jesus, you have given us the assurance that ask and you shall receive. Yes, Lord, with this faith and confidence and trust in you, we, your children, your family, bring to you our petitions, our prayers. For our Holy Father, Pope Francis, and all bishops, May the power of the Holy Spirit be upon them as they shepherd the faithful. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. All national and local civic leaders, may the Lord pour them share their consciences in promoting the dignity of human life from conception to natural death. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all who suffer from extreme weather conditions, and all who lack adequate housing or shelter, may the Lord protect and sustain them. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For this faith community, may our Lord Jesus stand to our every need in his mercy and love. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all those who have gone ahead of us, Guillermo Ramos, Jr., Julieta Javeliana, Danilo Tamayo, Edmond Ballesteros, Luisa Estenislao, Rafael Lopez, June Panello, Benita Cuell, Emilio Flores, Liberty Gonzalez, Arsenio and Antonio Reyes. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. For the healing of Imelda Santos, Regina Sagon, Denison Raval, Tim Chiung, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Thanksgiving, Del Sagala, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. In special intention for the Rabal family, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And now let us pause for our own special intentions. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Heavenly Father, thank you for the precious gift of life. Help us to cherish and protect this gift, even in the midst of fear, pain, and suffering. Give us life, give us love for all people, especially the most vulnerable, and help us bear witness 
to the truth that every life is worth living. Grant us the humility to accept help when we are in need and teach us to be merciful to all. Through our words and actions, may the others encounter the outstretched hands of your mercy. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. We make this prayer through Christ our Lord. For our Puerto Rico song, uh, How Great Thou Art, hymn 432. 432. Pray, my dear brothers and sisters, 
that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, our loving Father. May your people's oblation, O Lord, find favor with you, we pray, that it may restore them to holiness and obtain what they devoutly entreat through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And Lift up your hearts. Lift up Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is truly right, really right and just our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For although you have no need of our praise, yet our thanksgiving is itself your gift, since our praises add nothing to your good greatness, but profit us for salvation through Christ our Lord. And so in company with the choirs of angels, we praise you, and with the joy we proclaim. This is the most precious divine moments of the celebration. This is the gift of life. And we are celebrating the precious gift that God has given to each and every one of us. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your spirit upon them like the dew fall so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took a bread and giving thanks broke it and gave it to his disciples saying, take this all of you and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice. And once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks 
that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and the blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, Salvatore, our Archbishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed <coughs> Apostles, with Saint Augustine, Saint Monica, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you to your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant the peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, who said the apostles, peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. Amen. Let us share with one another a sign of peace. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that I should end under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. May the body and blood of Christ keep us safe for eternal life.
before communion song, turn to hymn 339, the supper of the Lord, hymn 339.
Let us pray. Humbly we ask you, Almighty God, be graciously pleased to grant that those you renew with your sacraments may also serve with the lives pleasing to you through Christ our Lord. Amen. At this time, I'd like to invite the homebound ministers to come forward. My dear sisters, you are sent to bring the word of God and the, blessed, the bread of life from this assembly to the sick and shut-in members of our Polish family. Go to them with our love and our prayers. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Please be seated for a moment. Come to the CD sponsored Ramad Sale and Put Sale tomorrow 8 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. and Sunday 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. This event will be held in the Paris Hall. Donations will be dropped off today in the Paris Hall. We have newly arrived images of Santo Nino. There will be a blessing of Santo Nino images on Saturday, the 13th of June. Feast day at 9 a.m. Bring your statue of Santo Nino or purchase one from the display, the side entrance of the church. Ghana Performing Arts. A visiting youth choir from the Philippines will be singing at mass and will perform a mini concert after the Eucharistic procession and home hospitality will follow. Join the Intercostal Church, the Legion of Mary and the Knights the of Columbus singing, singing. in the Walk for Life West Coast of Rally in San Francisco on Saturday, the 20th of January. There will be a Mass for the protection of the unborn, 9 a.m. shortly after the Mass hospitality will be served at the courtyard. Prior to the departure, 11 a.m. for Colma Park to get to San Francisco Civic Center. Thank you, Deacon Virgil. Before we ask Father Anthony to give us the final blessing, just a word of appreciation for your coming to the um, second day of our Novena for Life and also the last day of our Novena in preparation for the feast day of Santo Nino tomorrow. So this is our big celebration. I know there is a forecast of rain, so we will anticipate that, uh, plus bees, bring the little images you have at home so they can be blessed and we will probably have depending on the weather we'll have a short procession with the blessed sacrament and the images in the church and it will be concluded with benediction and then after that our visiting choir the Ganap performing arts youth group from the Philippines will perform a mini concert you know, in to continue the celebration of our Santo Nino and then after that we will uh, have a little fellowship. So this is all happening tomorrow at the 9 a.m. And also we take this opportunity to thank our visiting priest. You know, he was the state chaplain, a predecessor of mine two years ago when he led the Knights of Columbus, California State in their spiritual formation. Uh, Father Anthony Bas Hapili. Thank you. Father. <laughs> you know, on this second day of our novena, valuing about the precious of life. If, in fact, earlier, the, the one who led us in, in the prayers in the novena as, as, is our district master in the North Cal Northern California, uh, Brother Noel Panlilio. And, uh, he was accompanied by his wife, Lady Fanny Panlilio, for leading also the prayer. Of course, you know, we, we can't, uh, this is an ordinary day, we have a live music, and not just live music, we even have a choir 
you know, with the, the Knights of Columbus Dance and the band helping out. And of course, uh, we have several members of our um, Knights of Columbus officials who are here. We truly appreciate their presence. The Legion of Mary, who are also spearheading the Novena for Life, and some of the members of our parish, we thank them. And the liturgical ministers that have helped us carry out this liturgy in our live streaming. Father, we are live stream in, this, in the state um, uh, website and also uh, the St. Francis chapter. So a lot of our online viewers are tuned and praying with us as Father Anthony really highlighted what we are praying for, the preciousness and the sanctity of life. So thank you, Father, for that thank you, thank beautiful you. message. The Lord be with you. Amen. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Join us in uh, singing the recessional hymn, Let There Be Peace on Earth, hymn 531, 531.
sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine. All praise and all thanksgiving be every moment thine. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine. All praise and all thanksgiving be every moment thine. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine. All praise and all thanksgiving be every moment thine. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day rose again. You send it into heaven and see that the writing of the Father, you will come again to judge the living. And I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, communion of sin, the forgiveness of sin, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who have most need of thy mercy. sorrowful mysteries. First mystery is the agony in the garden. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who have most need of diamonds. Ave, Ave, Ave. The second sorrowful mystery is the scourging of the pillar. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 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 Glory. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be world without end. Amen. 
Oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who have most need of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave. The third sorrowful mystery is the crowning with thorns. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who have most need of thy mercy. The fourth sorrowful mystery is the carrying of the cross. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who have most need of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave. is the crucifixion and death of our Lord Jesus Christ. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, and Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, and Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, pool of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, pool of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, pool of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, pool of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, pool of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, pool of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, 
thee, pool of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who have most need of thy mercy. Salve Regina, Mater Misericordiae, Vita Dulce Do, Espes Nostra Salve. A te clamamos, exuis filiebe, a te suspiramos, gementes et plentes, ina clarima mumbae. Ea ergo, advocada nostra, Ilos tuus, misericordes oculos, alios converti. Et Jesum, benedictum proctum ventris tui, nobis pos auxilium ostidente. O Clemens, O Pia, O Dustes, Virgo Maria. Let us pray. O oh God, to my son, let's pray for us. To pray. To the same Christ, our Lord and our God. And now we continue our adoration to be with Jesus in the Blessed Sacrament Chapel. Yeah. 